Well, it's time that uh, we got to move on finding the princess. But first, but first, I do have something else to tell you. Um, after I reloaded the game, I realised that uh, it had taken all the junctions off Zell and Selfie because they left the party technically, which is bullshit because they're right here with me. Why would they leave the party in the middle of the mission? Don't quite understand it, but I had to just rejig everyone and try and get them the way they were. So um, yeah, the one thing I did do, however, I put pain. Uh, I gave the pain spells from Squall to Zell, and now he can uh, has well, it's on his status attack, so he has a chance of uh, poisoning. I think. Uh, inflicting darkness and silencing an enemy. 60%, so that's not too shabby. Um, apart from that, we're pretty much the same as you uh, as you left me. Oh, another thing. you notice uh, Zell is still level 8. He leveled up in the last video, but I, I wasn't happy with that. So I, uh, I reloaded, and I did that uh, fight with Laguna. Um, and made sure that no one leveled up, so that's cool. So... Um, yeah, he's back at level 8, so, uh, before we go find the princess, actually, there is something else I want to do. Um, this could take a while, in it, or it could not, but there is a card I want to get off this guy. Uh, Mr. Seed, you seem to know rules. I'm familiar to this region. Let's play a game with Balam's rules and ours, sir. Uh, well, that's fine, I don't mind that. Yeah, we'll play cards. Because so I think if we play him, um, the open rule will spread throughout the region, which is pretty cool. Um, and of course we have the trade rule difference, that's good as well, and same, well, that might come into play, we'll see. Um, but there is a special card I want him to play, and if he doesn't play it, I'll be annoyed. Oh, and there we go, you see the top of his deck there? That is the Angelo card, which uh, is a character we haven't actually met. I guess you could call it a character. Um, so we want to grab that card. Oh, and he's playing it. It's not the best of cards, I probably won't ever use it, but I might as well grab it if I get the chance, which uh, I do, so... Hmm. Right. The rest of his cards are pretty crap, so... Uh, we can we can afford to just take this. Nice and easy. They don't have a 7. No, none of them have a 7, so... This is, uh, this is gonna be nice and just a simple card game. Someone did comment on one of my earlier videos, I must have said that the open rule means you can use any card. Well, that's that's bullshit. It just means you can see the opponent's cards. <laughs> well done for pointing that out, whoever that was. And also, thanks for the uh, the comment. The guy, I uh, can't, can't remember the name, really sorry. That reminded me that Pain would be good to put on uh, status attack, so... I remembered to do that, and uh, we get all the cards, because we, we destroyed him. We destroyed Paul Watts. The open rule has spread throughout the region. Yes. That's what we want. Okay, I think we're good to go. Let's go find the princess. This music just seems perfect to play when you're, when you're deep in thought. You know, you're racking your brains trying to think how to do something. Um, the sound of the train moving. It's so relaxing. Yeah. What? You're gonna wake up the princess? You got some guts, man. You got some stones, man. Our princess is in the room further down. Why do they call her their princess? They must really like her. Or she might she might actually be royalty, but somehow I doubt that. I don't think there's any uh, royal families in the game. Not in Final Fantasy VIII. And let's go say hello to the princess. Who is someone we've seen before, funnily enough? That's a very girly room, that, isn't it? Not bad, though. Hey, you're, you know, from the party. So, does that mean you're a seed? Sure does. Yep, Squall, the squad leader. There's two others with me. Wow, that's uh, one hell of a welcome in. Take it easy, yeah. She's so happy. That's good. Send a request to Garden forever, but nothing. Oh. Oh, you spoke to Sid directly. Ah, that's why you were there then. Yeah, that must have been it. No? 
Yo, what? You know Cypher? Yeah, that douchebag. Well, he's the one who into Oh, he did, did he? City he is such a nice man, isn't he, old Robin? An easily little group. When after explaining our situation to him, Sid gave the go-ahead right, right away. Didn't take too much persuading, then. All kinds of plans. I can't wait to find out what those plans are. Oh, we have control again. Da -da 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 -da. Let's uh, let's try and find the uh, the underwear drawer. I mean, um, let's go speak to her. I wouldn't do such a thing. Yes. Going back to the others. Yeah. Let's -a go. Do 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 do. He? You mean Cipher? Yes. Um, no, he's not. He's not a seed because he sucks. He sucks big sweaty donkey balls. We don't even know her name. Oh, there we go. And uh, we get to name this character, Renoa. I'm just going to keep that name because, well, it's okay, I guess. Very pleased to meet you, Squall. Yeah, same here. The feeling's mutual. Seed members dance quite well. Well, <laughs> I don't know. Approach your target inconspicuously at a dance party. There may be missions requiring this sort of, uh... I... Oh, how do you say that? How do you say that word? Oh, I know how to say that word, but it's just... The pronunciation is just completely, uh... Evading me. Anyway. So it's work... That was, uh... A nice little... Reason there, Squall. I bet you just came up with that right on the dot. And here's Angelo! Um who we uh, have already seen on a card. No idea why Watts has uh, Angelo's card, but maybe Watts is the guy that kind of looks after Angelo when Renault is about uh, doing um, resistance stuff. Uh, we're not going to change his name, even though I'd like to... Actually, should I change his name? should name it after my dog, really, shouldn't I? Well, I think he's got two dogs now. Damn. Um... Doo -doo -doo. Then again, I don't really use... Uh, well, basically, this character is actually used in Renault's Limit Breaks, so I'm just going to keep that default name. Angelo is really smart. Here, let me tell you. Yep, she's going to explain it. Renault's Limit Break uses Angelo. Blah de blah de blah. You can teach him tricks, I think. Yeah, the Angelo Rush. And I think he'll, when she's low on health, he'll randomly come in uh, as well to battle to help her. Or something, or he'll just randomly appear. But um, don't really use Renoa that much, so to be honest, I'm not that familiar with her uh, limit breaks. But um, yeah, it looks like you can learn learn all these different tricks and stuff. So you can read this if you want. Now, as oh, Renoa walks around, the gauge will fill up, and Angela will learn the trick. All right. There'll be a message. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, let's skip this, skip this. We don't need to see this. Can we skip it? Why can't we? Oh, there we go. Yeah, very smart. Yeah. Nice little dog, isn't it? Oh, did you hear it then? It was like, oh, oh, oh. Oh. Don't you just want to kick him in the face? No! I'm a dog lover. I love dogs. Oh, poor little Angelo. I wonder if that's his room through there. Or something. You know, the I don't know. Anything to pick up in here that we can have a look at in her room while she's gone? No? I can smell the bed sheets. No! No! That's sick. You sick man, Squall. What's in these drawers? You're sick! Get out of there. You're you're on official garden business here. You can't be uh can't be messing around like that. Are these gonna so oh, he's asleep, okay. He must have been very relaxed by the sounds of the train. Strategy meeting. By the way, you're really lucky to come away without a scratch. Well, I get... I bet you guys just love to perv on her, and whenever you tried to go in a room, she attacked you, which is well within her rights, you know. We uh, reached our destination, that's why... Oh, did we stop? I didn't realise. You're looking after the train, jolly good. Do, do, do. 
Yeah. I don't know why, but Renoa's outfit always bothers me. I don't know why. I just don't like it that much. That's Zell, um, and Selfie, who... Are they gonna greet her at all? Are they gonna acknowledge her presence? Oh, yep. Hi, everyone! This way. Ooh. Where are we headed? Looks pretty dark in there. Oh, we can move. Alright, let's go in. Ah, just stand anywhere you want. Nice. Oh, and the epic mission music begins. Full-scale operation. Our resistance, the Forest Owls, will be forever known in the pages of Timber's independence. Exciting, indeed. It all started when we got a hold of uh, top-secret info. And Watt's got the info. He seems to be very proud of that. He also likes to uh, repeat what Zone's saying. Vinza Delling? Huh. He's a scoundrel. He's a dictator, not a president, not even popular in Galbadius, sir. He doesn't sound like a very nice chap. And he's got a private train from the Galbadian capital. The plan, should you choose to accept it, is blow it to smithereens with a rocket launcher. Whoa, Selfie, whoa, where did that come from? Not quite. You know, I think Selfie's a bit of a psychopath. She does uh, have these little random outbursts of craziness. I think that's why I like Selfie. It's just a little bit unhinged, you know? First, I'll go over the model. They've built a model uh, of a railway. Yellow train at the top right is our base. Right next to it is the dummy car. We made it look just like the president's car. The locomotive. Red car is the president's car. The last car is the second escort. Ultimate goal is to seize the president in his car using our base. That means you'll have to switch our dummy car with the president's car. Ooh. Ah, this sounds like quite the operation, to be honest. Alright, sneak on board the second escort. We'll get on the roof, jumping from our dummy car. That sounds safe. Um, sensors. High-tech officer is on board. That doesn't sound good. Good, okay. Delling hates the company of his guards and being surrounded by sensors and keeps them away from his... Well, that's clever, isn't it? <laughs> he deserves to be kidnapped. I'll have to complete the uncoupling before the first switch point. If we don't... Boom! Game over, game over, man. Yeah, so I'll have to move fast. I'll explain the uncoupling process later. After this, uh, after the car is uncoupled, we'll have the dummy car and our base move in. At this point, our train and their train will be linked and be moving together. Oh my god. We will become one. Couple of second escort car. Uh, the process will probably be similar to the first one. I'll tell you right now, I, I really don't like the uncoupling parts of this mission. I always suck at them, but anyway. Uh, should we be able to escape? with the president's car. After that, return to base and prepare to confront him. Some interrogation. I have some ideas. We can have some fun with this guy. Five minutes to complete. I hate time limits. I always... I don't do well under pressure. I don't know, Zell. Oh, only take three minutes in a simulation that you ran? What kind of simulation was that? Too easy. Squall's just like, not too sure about this. Okay, Watts is going to tell us how to uh, get over the sensors. They have a sound sensor and a temperature sensor. Sensor. <coughs> Any sound will trigger the sound sensor. Well, that makes sense. So move across very quietly. Be very quiet. I'm hunting. Where it? Uh, the blue guard is carrying this sensor. How do they know this? 
Watts must be really the, uh, the intelligence gatherer. The guard in red is carrying that one. Okay, so... When a guard opens it at the blind, that means he is checking the sensors and being careful. The range of these sensors is equal to the length of one window. <laughs> so keep an eye on the window below. Simple. Basically, you run or stop, depending on which guard is below you. Alright, okay, this doesn't sound too difficult. Just a bit of an inconvenience. Now this, this is... Oh, Selfie's got a question. How can you uncouple the cars from a moving train? With great difficulty! Here's your answer. Instead, we'll have to tamper, tamper with the control system. Of course, the control system! Why didn't I think of that? Have to enter several... Oh, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. And, uh... Renault has the codes. How the hell have they got this information, really? Squall, you'll slide down on the side of the train using a cable and enter the codes. Oh, that sounds really cool. Uh, I need you to uh, listen carefully, for I shall say this only once. Each code is made up of numbers, one to four, four digits, so yeah. So they'll call out the numbers and you've got to press the right bloody buttons, and I always forget which one's which. Yeah. I hate that. I really do. Um, it's a pain. Uh, you got five seconds to enter each code. Otherwise, the code will change and the past entries will become invalid. So, you got to be careful. Yep. Oh, I got to practice now, do I? I'm gonna make an ass of myself. If you want to quit, hold down L right. Okay. Four, one, two, four. Four, one, two, four. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Two, three, four, four. Two, three, four, four. Four, four, three, four. Whoa, shit, I did it wrong! That was silly. Four, two, three, one. Four, two, three, one. Okay, I did fuck up, but that was that was just like getting out of the way so that when I do it for real, there'll be no mistakes. And that's all. Well, a piece of piss. We'll do this. Model's nice, but the president's car looks kind of shabby. Why is that? Uh, Renault made it, that's why. <laughs> now that's a tad harsh. That squall's thinking, yeah, it kind of does. Oh, of course. Very nicely recovered there, Renella. I don't think anyone believes you, but it's a nice, uh... Oh, what? So, really the ugliest things you've ever seen in your life? I wouldn't say that. Yeah, enough talking about a bloody model. Let's, uh, let's do the mission. I do understand, yes. Ah, uh, okay, the party. Gathering information is my speciality, sir. Oh, and Zone's having another case of the, uh, the upset stomach. Oh, hello. We're moving again. Ah, uh, right then. Talk to Watts when you're ready. Okay, the sooner the better. Yeah, yeah. Anything in here? Oh, there's a clipping from a magazine. Let's read it. Anarchist Monthly, first issue. Galbadia's dictator, President Vinza Delling Special. How does he stay in power? We reveal his darkest secrets. Well, that was interesting. Why would you read the title and not read the... I want to have to learn his darkest secrets. Although, maybe we, when we're interrogating him, with pliers and, and drills, that uh, we can get that information from him first hand. Uh, poor Zone is, is really struggling there. That's what happens when you pull your pud too often. 